This is an example of a tricky permutation. It's actually two permutations combined. So if you want to give this a try, go for it. I'm going to launch into the explanation. We have three tables that we have to concern ourselves with. And each of these tables has a five member debate team. So on each of these tables, we have five seats and we have five members of the team that could go into these five seats that could fill them. So each of these seats of five with five members would be five times four times three times two times one for the permutation, which is the same as five factorial. So each of these seatings is five factorial. Now, if we were just saying, okay, we're gonna order these where team A goes here, team B goes here, and team C goes here, the total seating orders from left to right would be five factorial times five factorial times five factorial. But now we can also reorganize the groups as well. So we could flip flop group B and group C. We could do the same thing with A and B and C. And basically how many ways can we reorganize the groups themselves? Well, we have three groups and we have three spots. So the permutation for the groups is going to be six different ways in which we can arrange the groups. Now, if we multiply the six ways we can arrange the groups times five factorial times five factorial times five factorial, we will get our solution. And we will not solve this out because it is too large of a number, but this is the answer to our question.